Hey guys, so today we're going to be doing the three marker Christmas challenge. Namely, the elf on the shelf. And Rudolph. And Rudolph. If you're wondering why we are sitting so close to each other, it's because we have this little camera overhead, so. Yeah, so it's not very nice even. view of the overhead coloring. Yeah. So. The problem is, um, well, actually. The problem is I haven't taken a shower in two days. No, the problem is she's a, she's a right-handed, so that means her elbow's gonna be like this, and it's gonna I'll be fine. But good thing I'm not left-handed, because I'd be like this. Yeah. We're good, we good, we good. All right, so let's pick out our colors. Me first. Carly first. Hold it up for the world to see. It's good? Okay. And we got this. Yep. Got this one. And yeah, this one. Okay. Ooh, which one are we doing? Can we do Rudolph? Or no, Ellie? we're doing the elf. So Carly got. This is actually not bad. So we can make her a blonde. We can make um, pink and purple. Very good. All right, so now it's my turn to pick. Mm. I'm just going for the food. No, you have four. Put one back. One, four. I'm pretty good. Ooh, so I have red, pink, and purple. With yellow. The yellow bead in it. With the yellow bead in it. Mine has a gray bead in it. Alright, are we ready? Yep. On your marks. Get set. Go. Oddly, I'm going to make the elf's outfit red. And this one actually smells really good. It smells like popcorn. Wait, hold on. Where's the good smelling one though? That's the same color. One of them smells like cheese. Sorry, they're the same color. This one just smells better. It's hard to see flies on the counter because we have like the weird like granite, the granite look counter. The granite it. The granite it. The granite look counter. So um, the flies kind of just blend right in. Not like we have flies everywhere. You act like you're talking like there's flies all over. That's one. And once in a while, I'm sure everyone has at least one fly in there. Yes, but we don't like constantly have flies all over our house. Flies leave maggots. It's yummy. It's gross. <laughs> I can actually tell a really yucky story from my younger days about maggots. I don't know. If anyone wants to hear. I do. So, my friend, and I'm not gonna say any names and I was probably like 21 at the time 22 or whatever but she had a car she had like two two kids and I don't know her kids just used to always eat in the car all the time and then like so she was cleaning out her car the one day and she like took the she moved like the car seats out of the way and there was like maggots Ew. Yeah. Oh, I think she had like a bad smell in her car and there was like food that her kids like left on, and it was under the car seat. But anyway, she like took her car to the car wash and she literally like took the hose that you spray to like wash your car and she like filled the inside of her car with water. The entire thing? Yeah. To wash it out. Does she still have that car? No, she does not. But yeah, it's a pretty gross story. What are you doing? <laughs> like that was a good idea. That was not a good idea. I saw. Mm. I keep on missing it, okay? My grandma's really good at sneak attacking those things. She actually is. She can grab them with her bare hands. Which is gross. It is gross. Aww. You all seem too thrilled. I think this is probably as good as it is. Maybe she'll have a pink face. I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to ruin it if I give her a pink You should face. give her a pink eye. Pink eye? Mm -hmm. Like she has a pink eye infection? Mm -hmm. She needs to go to the doctor. She has pink eye. Well, I give her some red lips. I can give mine a pink eye too. I feel like maybe I should do this. 
just to add a pop more color. I feel like mine was out of the photo. Guys, sorry if my, my picture comes out of the photo. I'm just always like dragging it towards me. And what are you most excited for about Christmas? Seeing family. That would be fun to see family. Anything else? Ellie. Ellie. The much anticipated return of Ellie Sparkle. Mm -hmm. And she may already be back by the time we post this video. Alright, so I think I'm done. I'm done. This is Harry Potter's elf. What's it, what's Harry Potter's elf name? Harriet Elf. Harriet Elf. <laughs> okay, guys, so you decide. Harriet Potter. Who is the winner? <laughs> Carly or me? Obviously, you have to do me. I had to say you have Harry to pick Potter. me because my elf is wearing red, like most traditional elves. Well, wear. my well, mine is um, I'm like unique. So. Vote mine because she's very unique, and she's gonna have some earrings. Remember the the Looks the like dog ear is bleeding. No, she has the. Oh. She's gonna have um, the elder wand earring. An elder wand earring. Yep. So vote mine, please. Wait, no, wait. I'm no, sorry. Wait. Hey. Next round. I was gonna make mine look like Voldemort. Volder elf. Okay. Now we're doing Rudolph. He who shall not be named. Can I pick first this time? No. Okay. Pick your three. Not bad. It's not bad? Okay. No. Nope. You pick two. There's your second one. Now one more. You get one more. What are you doing here? Just pick one. Pick one. Just, ah, pick one. Yay! Carly got good colors. Wait, 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 wait. I need to stop this. Okay, go. Go. Okay, that's actually good. I have a feeling you can see. I can't see anything. <laughs> you got neon yellow. I got fluorescent yellow, brown, and pink. All right, you ready? You ready? Yeah. Okay. I promise I'm not cheating. They're the same color they did. This one just smells better. One of them smells like cheese. That one. That okay. smells like cheese. You ready? So what is on your wish list for Christmas? A magic caster wand. A magic caster wand. And what is the magic caster wand in case people don't know? So it's basically um, a wand designed by J.K. Rowling, the person who made the Harry Potter books. And um, basically if you install certain light bulbs, you there's a spell called Lumos Maxima, which turns on lights, so you can basically turn on your lights with a wand, and you can duel with your friends, so you can like fight with wands. Anyone? Not like fight, you can just do boom, and then it'll affect their wand. I know it's on your Christmas list. What's on my Christmas list? Jewelry. When do I ever ask for jewelry? You ask Daddy every year for a diamond ring. I know. That's a joke. Or is it now? I already have a diamond ring. You do? Yes. From where? My wedding ring. Oh. That I always forget to put on. Daddy does. No, actually he does. Sometimes. He has it on. He like wears it when he goes places. Which I guess is good. So all the ladies know that's my man. <laughs> Alright. He wears it normally. He wears like one of those like rubber oh, he doesn't ones. actually wear his real. He wears a like a rubber band. <laughs> a thick rubber band. Like just because it's he doesn't want to lose it. Or damage it, because he works outside a lot. Ooh. He did lose it at one point. He did, and then he found it. Thankfully. 
Else he would have been sleeping in the doghouse. We don't have a dog. It's an expression. Yeah, Loki's literally just laying on the floor right there. He's chilling. He has like three beds. He has one in my room. Like, it's not he, my carpet. Something to sleep on. He has my old, old comforter on the floor right outside of the territory where we keep his bed and his water bowls and his food bowl. I actually want to get him another bed. Another one? Just for like closer, cause he likes to like sit, if we're watching TV in here, he likes to kind of lay near us and stuff. So we can get, maybe we should get one for my room too, cause Loki likes to sit in my room with me. He booped me on the nose in the middle of the night the other day. It was so cute. Like I just feel something wet in my face and startled me and I see Loki with a little toy in his mouth like, hi. Loki loves Carly, like he loves Carly so much. Like usually whenever she comes near him, like his tail starts wagging. And he follows me. Yeah, he follows her around. He also likes people. He does. Well, you have to get to know him if you, if you, um, for the most part, he likes everybody. He's sometimes that's not a good thing. Like if someone with girls, like he likes girls more than like grown men. We're nicer. I don't know. Um, when he was a puppy, and I don't know if the, this even stays with him or whatever, but he was in a house. Like the people that we got him from, like had like tons of little girls. They had a bunch of little girls. And he's our little old man, grumpy old man. Yeah. We love our Loki. Yeah, he's the best. He's the best dog he has. Okay. All right, very good. That's a really bad part. We heart. Vote for me because we love you. I love you too. Okay, Rudolph, like look at you that. That's you. one good Rudolph. Like hers looks good, but not as good as mine. Like look, I have the red nose, the red ears, and Loki loves you. If you love Loki, vote for me. If you really love Loki, vote for me. You can't take my thing. But just saying no one will love Loki like I love Loki. I buy him all his treats and snacks and foods and I was the one who snuck the goose into the, your your cart. The she other did day. that. She did. We were grocery shopping for like Thanksgiving and um, she took a dog toy and she snuck it into the cart. Whenever I go back, and they were ringing up so fast, I didn't even notice until like I was putting the bags in the cart. Wait, and I, was like, I can grab it. I'm like, how did this get back in the cart? He loves it. It's very drooly. <laughs> drooly. Attack! Okay guys, we hope you liked this video. If you did, make sure to thumbs up, subscribe, bye!